Hi students, this animation and description would help you to learn physics even more easier and better. So please do watch it and enjoy learning physics. X-ray spectra, continuous and characteristic X-ray spectra. The spectrum from an X-ray tube contains two distinct parts. Continuous X-ray spectra. It consists of radiations of all possible wavelengths from a certain lower limit to higher values continuously as in the case of visible light. Origin. Continuous X-ray spectra. X-rays are produced when high-velocity electrons strike the target material of high atomic number. It has also been mentioned in the production of X-rays that most of the energy of the electrons goes into the heating of the target material. A few fast-moving electrons penetrate deep into the interior of the atoms of the target material and are attracted towards the nuclei by the attractive forces of their nuclei. Due to these forces, the electrons get deflected from their original path. As a result of this, the electrons are decelerated and hence energy of the electron decreases continuously. This loss of energy during retardation is given off in the form of X-rays of continuously varying wavelength. The X-rays consist of continuous range of frequencies up to a maximum frequency, new max or minimum wavelength lambda minimum. This is called as continuous X-rays. The minimum wavelength depends on the anode voltage. If V is the potential difference between the anode and the cathode, EV is equal to H nu maximum, that is equal to Hc by lambda minimum. Since mu is equal to c by lambda, the minimum wavelength of the given radiation is lambda minimum is equal to hc by ev. Where h is Planck's constant, c is the velocity of light and e the charge of electron. Substituting the known values in the above equation, lambda minimum is equal to 6.626 into 10 raised to minus 34 into 3 into 10 raised to 8. The whole divided by 1.6 into 10 raised to minus 19 into V. That is equal to 12,400 divided by V angstrom. For the given operating voltage, the minimum wavelength is same for all metals. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe this channel for more videos.